about Volkov. I know last time you were you were aggressive. You know, it seems like uh, you know Rosenstruck was a little conservative. Do you want to go out there and try and and knock Volkov out so you can um, you know if, if any of the fans thought there wasn't enough action in your last fight? Do you want to try and give them a lot of action this fight? Yes, 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 one hundred percent. My fight against uh, Jairzinho was a little bit uh, special because uh, we are really focused on, on, on his contra because we know Jairzinho finished uh, all his fight with the, with the contra. Yeah. So we was really focused on it. So that's why maybe I don't finish the fight before the end. I was comfortable in the distance and in the close distance, but not in the middle distance from like a KO. Uh, yeah. Now I think it's going to be, yeah, yes, yes, that's true. It's going to be different. I think... Uh, I can manage uh, in the long distance, middle distance, and close distance. So everything is possible. And I want to finish the fight every time. Seems like, and obviously you have a relationship with Francis. It seems like the Francis and Derek fight has just not been able to be put together. Do you think that you could, if you beat Volkov, could you slide in and get a title shot next? Uh, could you be Francis's next opponent? Uh parce qu'en gros, c'est parce que Derek Lewis, il n'est pas... En fait, le combat, ouais. c'est pour ça que ça va pas se faire. Est-ce que tu penses que c'est pour toi Je ne sais pas. Je ne sais pas. C'est une question pour question for, 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 for the UFC. Je ne sais pas exactement. Mais pourquoi pas Oui, allons-y. Je suis allé. Do you think you... Obviously, Dana is going to make the decision, but do you think you deserve... I mean, I think you could make a strong case that you deserve it if you beat Volkov. Do you think you deserve it Yes, of course. If you call me out, I'm here. You hear a lot of fans talking about John Jones going to heavyweight. What, as a guy who is one of the best heavyweights in the world, what do you make of John Jones leaving the light heavyweight division and coming to the heavyweight division and maybe getting a title shot? What, where do you, what do you think of John Jones and making uh, this move to heavyweight? I think it's a good move uh, from him, of course. Uh, he can make a lot of money with that. Yeah. And, um, he did a lot in the light heavyweight, so I understand his move for the heavyweight division. He want to prove something. But after, uh, yes, of course, <laughs> there are a lot of people in this division, and we are really two to the to the title shot. So yes, every time the people say, "Yeah, John Jones, John Jones," but we are here too. <laughs> right. Well, I'm sure you grew up. You know, I'm sure you watched John, right, uh, as you were getting into the sport. Is he somebody that you are interested in stepping in that octagon with in the future? Oh, yes, of course, of course. Uh, a lot of people talk about this fight because I look like a, a guy, technical, a fighter, um, a technical fighter, sorry. So, and he is too a technical fighter. So the people like to say, yeah, this is a good matchup. Probably it's going to be a good matchup. So, yes, I'm really excited about that because John Jones is the GOAT and everybody knows that. So, wow. How do you think your styles match up? How would that fight look if we do get that one day? And I know the fans would love it. How would the fight look? The, what? I think uh, it's going to be uh, that would be really that will be really uh, I don't remember the name. Do you remember like yeah, even, 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 exactly, even, even. <laughs>